After training for more than 20 years, I have found out one flaw, one weakness that stops many people from getting better in communication and speaking confidently. No, 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 no. That is not about English. That is not about grammar. That is not about words and sentences. No, it is not about that. This flaw, this weakness is about procrastination. Procrastination is our tendency, our mindset where we postpone important things. We postpone and we don't do it in time. And the same problem is there with communication also. Well, if you think procrastination is only connected with your communication, it's not like that. See, understand one thing. If you procrastinate in your everyday life, you procrastinate here also in communication also. Procrastination is like habit. Once you get the habit, you procrastinate everywhere. You procrastinate in paying your bills. You procrastinate in, you know, going to gym. You procrastinate to do any positive change. You procrastinate in communication improvement also. And that affects your entire life. I have seen people who tell me that, yeah, I mean, I want to work on my communication. Actually, my promotion is pending. Actually, my growth has stopped. But... I will start next month, I will start next year and the next month and next year and next Monday has never come and they are every day postponing and procrastinating, they are going nowhere, they are on a treadmill. I remember once one of my, I can't say him student because he hasn't joined my institute yet. Since 2011 he is saying that I want to work on my communication but I don't have time. Now, when you say you don't have time, it means you procrastinate, you don't want to face it, you want to avoid it. And why do people avoid communication? The reason is fear. They huh? are afraid that if they uh, work on the communication, they have to go on the stage, they have to speak in front of people, they will make mistakes and people will make fun of their English. It will be scary. I won't be able to handle this. Why to do this? Instead of, the best option is <laughs> procrastinate that. Next Monday, next month, next year, maybe next life, I don't know. Well, this is the main reason why people do not work on their communication. They want, they know that it's very important. They know that it's, it has stopped their growth. They know, but they're procrastinating. I know there are many people who want to join my communication classes, but they are procrastinating. I will, and it's, you know, it's very easy to procrastinate. I mean, you are temporary, you feel so nice and relaxed. No tension, calm down. But the effects in the long term are disastrous. You have to pay the price for procrastination. If you think that procrastination is not going to affect you. It's going to create a walk, a disaster in your life. And I have seen people oh, no. slowly, slowly failing in life due to procrastination. It can be about health. It can be about savings. It can be about communication skills. It can be anything. Well, I know what you're thinking. Well, then what is the solution? Answer is simple. Go and face it. Procrastination is there because we don't want to face it. Because we are afraid to face it. And why we are afraid? Because we feel we can't handle, we can't deal. Oh, we don't no. have the strength. But let me tell you one thing. You have the strength. You have the willpower. You have that in you. But you don't trust you. And how will you trust you without doing? First you have to do that. First you have to perform. First you have to go and face. Only then you will realize that you have that in you. So guys, stop procrastinating about communication. Stop procrastinating about giving that presentation. Stop procrastinating about starting to read a book. Start procrast stop, stop, stop this. Stop this. It is taking your life. You are 20, 30 now. Some of you are 40 years old. When are you going to start this? Hurry up. Time is not like we don't have 100 and 200 years left. When you are going to do that, get up, 
Get up, push up yourself. No one is going to come and motivate you. You have to do it. Go and talk to your boss. Go and tell him, I'm going yes. to give the next presentation. Go and book for any public speaking talk. Go and join any communication training institute. Not my, any communication training institute. Don't procrastinate. And when you join actually, yeah, first day will be very scary. Very nervous. Oh. You will feel like, wow, why I did this? I mean, I watched Sandeep Patil's <laughs> video and I got motivated. I should not have done that. But when you finish your task, that happiness, that sense of achievement, that satisfaction cannot be termed, in, cannot be said in terms of words. It's unimaginable. And that's my experience. Dear friends, take small steps every day towards your communication. Start reading. Don't procrastinate, postpone. Start speaking with your spouse, your friends. Improve your communication. Don't postpone. Go and go and listen to a good podcast. Don't procrastinate. Go on the stage. Go on the dice. Go there and rock everyone. Don't procrastinate, dear friends. Don't procrastinate. In the comments, you have to write, I will do it and not procrastinate. Write in the comments, I will do it and not procrastinate. My best wishes to you. Remember last line, talent is not important. Action is important. There are many people who are talented but not taking actions and they are procrastinating. And you are not in that category. Best wishes to you. Come on. Go and rock and take action. Don't procrastinate. Bye-bye. Thank you.